A year ago, I was at Kampung Haka Mantin for a tour of their 150-year-old historical village. I made several videos of the Haka homes, alumni hall and clan temple. Today, I revisited their village at an event called Light in Kampung Haka, organized by Rakan Mantin. I was shocked when I arrived. The alumni hall and several homes were demolished. This old man, Mr. Yap, told us how the authorities came to destroy his home. When he tried to stop them, he was arrested and put in the police lockup for two days. When he was released, he came back to a destroyed home. He could not save anything. Everything he owned in the house was not taken out and destroyed when they demolished his house. Even his dog was not spared. The poor animal was simply tied to a tree when Mr. Yap was arrested. When he came home, he found his dog half-starved and probably suffering from sunstroke. It died the next day. Some familiar faces were still at Kampung Haka. This old lady whom I met last year was still there. One of the houses had been turned into a multi-purpose hall. Parked in front are colourful bicycles that visitors can use to ride around the village. This morning, Rakan Mantin organised visits to the Dewi Sri Maha Mariaman Tirutondor Teravai and Gudrawa Sahib.